This has long been the philosophy at the Trump Organization. At my father's company, there are more female than male executives. Women are paid equally for the work that we do, and when a woman becomes a mother, she is supported, not shut out. Women represent 46% of the total U.S. labor force, and 40% of American households have female primary breadwinners. In 2014, women made 83 cents for every dollar earned by a man. Single women without children earn 94 cents for each dollar earned by a man, whereas married mothers made only 77 cents. As researchers, as researchers have noted, gender is no longer the factor creating the greatest wage discrepancy in this country. Motherhood is. As president, my father will change the labor laws that were put in place at a time when women were not a significant portion of the workforce. And he will focus on making quality childcare affordable and accessible for all. As a mother myself of three young children, I know how hard it is to work while raising a family. And I also know that I'm far more fortunate than most. American families need relief. Policies that allow women with children to thrive should not be novelties, they should be the norm. Politicians talk about wage equality, but my father has made it a practice as, at his company throughout his entire career. He will fight for equal pay, for equal work, and I will fight for this too, right alongside of him.